Nash. It's a bantamweight title fight between Mitch Gagnon and the former all-time WEC champion, Uriah Faber. He is the California kid, Uriah Faber, one of the most beloved and popular mixed martial artists of all time. The former WEC featherweight champion defended his title a record five times. He has always competed at the highest level inside the octagon. Faber has been one of the premier fighters in the smaller weight classes for years. He was a dominant featherweight champion back in the WEC, great stand-up, and a ton of natural athleticism. He's tough as nails, too, and can fight through tremendous adversity. Uriah Faber ready to battle and take home the title. Set to enter the octagon to defend his title. The champion is in focus. He is in his prime. He's making his way towards the cage. His training for this camp has been absolutely spectacular. He believes he has a solid game plan, and his mentality coming into this fight is clear and focused. Ready to defend the UFC Bantamweight title. Our tail of the tape for our main event of the evening. Gagnon is 31. Faber is 36. He will have a two-inch reach advantage. With the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Staples Center in Los Angeles, California. And Fishy's kicks. Gagnon gets hit with the kick. Very nice. Hooks. 
Swing and a miss. Beautiful body shot there. Big Sam. combination. Two combo by Fade. Wow, what a great job mixing things up. And again, he connects with the kick. Lands a hard kick. to the Muay Thai clinch. Daniel has got him in the plum clinch. Good hook in the clinch by Faber. And again, the hook lands. They battle in the clinch, looking for a dominant position. <laughs> Just missed with the right hand. Good jab. Nice inside leg kick. He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Knee to the body by the champ. Counter uppercut by Daniel. Joe wants oh, jumping knee. Clean overhand. 20 seconds. Big takedown. Oh, he's worked himself to double underhooks. And he pulls away. Five minutes in the books. Round one complete. There's a nice leg kick. And here's another beautiful leg kick. And there's another excellent leg kick. Amazing highlights from that round. That was a great round. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two. That last round was an all out. Oh, flying knee. Oh, head kick. Hard hook. Huge uppercut. Connects with the hook to the head. He's really doing a good job of controlling distance and getting off these shots. Inside leg kick. Man, the damage to his thigh is so excessive. I don't know how much longer he can stay in this fight. He's got him in his guard. All right, we take a look at the takedowns landed so far. Misses the takedown. Boy, he is swinging for the fences. That's a solid kick. Mitch Gambio really put on a striking clinic tonight. He's landed some really big shots in this fight, big power shots, and that's what's winning the fight for him. He's got a very nice right hook, Mike. He 
blocks the punch. Nice body kick. Oh, body. good shots the body. Wow, he's really working the body here, Mike. Genuine with the inside leg kick. Oh, there beautiful combination. Oh, he left your elbow. huge elbow. Oh. The champ is in big trouble. Could this be it? Could we have a new champion? Under three now. The flying knee. Genuine with a hook to the body. He's able to parry the strike. Both men landing in that exchange. Combination. He slips the punch. Oh, another nasty late kick. knockout blow to finish the fight here. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. Here is Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop 